Okay, hi everyone. Welcome to class today. We're all a bit uh, late, so I will skip this part. Okay, before class begins, I will introduce myself first. My name is Queen, and I will be your teacher for the class today. All right. So, yes, I'm Bruce. We are Shik Pafala, but our topic today is where to study abroad. And today we will have a discussion about the place that you want to study. All right, so let's start with the first question. The vocabulary game. A student try to pronounce correctly all the words below. All right, so let's see if you remember the last lesson or not. Okay, so hello, Miss Oin. Okay. <coughs> okay, let's introduce a little bit about yourself and then try to pronounce all the words in this life for me, okay? Yes, I do. Uh, good evening, teacher and everyone. My name is Wang. I'm 24 years old and I'm in the food province. Uh, I work and live in city. My hobby are traveling, watching movies, shopping. Nice to meet you. Okay, nice to meet you. Now, please pronounce all the words below, okay? From yes. study. Yes, I see. Study, master, university. Cholak, Cholakship, mm -hmm. uh, System, Education, Steel, Friendship. Okay. Hey, there's two words I want you to say again. Scholarship. Scholarship. Okay, scholar, scholarship. Scholarship. All right, very good. Next, friendship. Friendship. Okay, the sh sounds. Friendship, scholarship. <coughs> okay. Uh, friendship. All right. Okay, thank you, Miss Oin. Okay, and welcome to the class today. Okay, so let's turn to Mr. Sien. Hello, Mr. Sien. Hello, teacher. Mm, can you introduce shortly about yourself and then pronounce all the words below for me? Okay. Yes, I am. I am Sian. I twenty six years old. I am. I'm an engineer. Um, I. Uh, I'm from Hai Dương Province and live in Hanoi. I. My hobbies are uh, listening, listening to music and um, traveling with my friends. Uh, nice to meet you. You're right. Nice to meet you, Mr. Sin. So now, please pronounce all the words here. Yes. Study. Master. University. Scholarship. System. Education, still, friendship. All right, good. Can you say again this word? Study. Study. Yes, good. And system. System. Yeah, okay, much better. All right, very good. Thank you, Mr. Sian. Okay, and welcome to the class night our last class all right so let's turn to mr nia yes good evening okay. teacher and everyone my name is nia i'm living in ho chi minh city i'm 38 years old my hobbies are listening to music uh, traveling uh, surfing the web and playbook <laughs> 
Okay, nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you, Mr. Nia. Yeah, so now can you pronounce? Oops, all the words below? Yes, study. Study. Master. Very good. University. Scholarship. System. Education. Still. Friendship. Alright, very good. Can you say this again? Scholarship. 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 Yes, good. Study. 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 Very Study. Good. Yes. System. 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 Yes. System. Okay. Sis. Yeah. Very system. good. System. system. Look. Look at the S here. System. Yes. Very good. All right. Thank you, Mr. Mia. Yes. Good practice. Also, missing up. I couldn't connect. I couldn't control your microphone. Okay. Okay. You can connect. Uh, you can contact with our PO to uh, resolve those problems. So let's turn to Mr. Cook. Uh, Ms. Yeah. Cook. Okay. Hello, Ms. Cook. Hello, teacher. Okay. Can you introduce a little yes. bit about yourself? Mm, uh, hello, teacher. My name is Cook. Uh, I'm 26 years old. I um, live in uh, the nice city and the nice growing. Um, my hobby are traveling and uh, reading book. Yeah, um, that's for me. I to miss you. Okay, very good. So yeah. now. Can you pronounce all the words below? Yeah. Study. Matter. University. Scholarship. System. Education. So. Friendship. Yes. Okay. Good. Still. Can I say again? Still. 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 Okay. Still. Eel. Steel. Yes. System. System. Okay. Look at the S here. We have two S. System. System. Yes, that's good. That was the correct pronunciation. All right. And scholarship. scholarship. Yes, very good. Okay, thank you, Ms. Cook, and welcome to the class today. So let's turn to uh, Mr. Ah uh, Yes, teacher. I am Kuman, teacher. Uh, good, uh, uh, good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Uh, my name is Tang. I'm living in Ho Chi Minh City. I'm 45 years old. I'm working coffee and paper restaurant now. Uh, my hobbies are traveling, postpone listening to music and reading books. In my free time, I usually go to the bookstore. Nice to meet you, teacher, and everybody. Okay, nice to meet you, Miss Tang. So now, can you pronounce correctly all the words below? Uh, yes. A study. study. A master. University. Scholarship. System, education, still, friendship. All right, very good, very good practice. Okay, thank you, Miss Tang, and welcome to the class today. All right, so Miss Ngoc, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Hello, Miss Ngoc. Hello. Okay, okay. So, Hello. Uh, can you introduce <coughs> shortly about yourself? Uh, yeah. Yes. Uh, hello, teacher. Hello, class. My name is Ngoc. Uh, I am uh, 28 years old, and uh, now I'm uh, work for human resource management, and uh, I like listening to music, playing piano, and um, traveling. Nice to meet you. Alright, nice to meet you, Miss Ngoc. 
So now, please pronounce correctly all the words below. Yes. Study, master, university, mm -hmm. scholarship, system, education, still, friendship. All right. Yes, that's good. Can you say this word again? Education. Education. Yes, very good. All right. Thank you, Miss Ngoc, and welcome to the class. Okay. Abroad. So we have finished this part. You guys uh, did a very good job, and also I uh, recollect what uh, pronounced you uh, uh, haven't uh, pronounced correctly yet. So. Okay, that's all for this part. So let's turn to question two. Okay, Age. What is the best country for studying abroad and why? Okay, let's see. What is your best country? So, Miss Wang, can you share with me what is the best country you want to study and why? What? I want to. Um, I want to study. Alright, Miss Yes, I hear you. Oh, sorry, can you speak louder? Yeah. Okay, okay. Keep speaking. Alright. I hear you. Um I want to I want to study in around um Australia. Uh, because because um, Australia is a beautiful country um, um, uh, also uh, yes. anything else? Uh, on, also uh, Sydney is a well known for talk University uh, and Australia are set country um poly kai the poly the kai I think so. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. So we want to study in Australia. All right. Thank you, Ms. Wang, about your sharing. Okay. So let's see if uh, Mr. Sin, what is your best country for studying and why? Oh, uh, yes. I think um, um, American uh, is the best country for study studying abroad because. Um, uh, American is um, um, American uh, is well known for top university. Um, also, is a uh, peaceful, politically stable, and safe country. Uh, and uh, American is also um, un unfaced by natural disaster. Um, yes, mm -hmm. and uh, Harvard is one of the most famous universities in American. Yes. It's not also for America. Is uh, Harvard is famous all over the world for its uh, education system, right? Okay. Thank you, Mr. Sin, about your sharing the country that you want to study abroad, and um, you say America, not American. American is oh, the people. Yes. Or something belong to America. Uh, America. Yes, America. America. Okay. Oh, that, that's, that's great. Okay, thank you, Mr. Sian. 
Okay, so let's turn to Mr. Nia. Okay, what is the best country for studying abroad and why? Yes, so I think that's uh, the best country for studying abroad is America. The same answer, mm -hmm. the same with the Middle East. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so why? Uh, why do you think America is the best country for studying abroad? That's yes, uh, because uh, the uh, America uh, have uh, uh, education development and uh, have many many uh, the university uh, stop uh, in the world. Yes. Okay, anything else? Oh, uh, that's all. Okay, thank you, Mr. Nia, for your sharing. Okay, we have two people choose America for the best country for starting abroad. So let's see. Okay, Ms. Ngoc, how about your opinion? What is the best country for starting abroad and why? In my opinion, the best country for studying abroad is America too, mm -hmm. because it's one of the best higher education system in the world, and you can access to advanced technology and resources, and uh, you you can have opportunities to. Um, uh, uh, approach um, nature, beautiful nature, cultural history, and very multi cultural population. And uh, uh, after that, you will have opportunity to find a good job. That's, that's my opinion. In America. Mm, okay. Yeah. Hey, thank you, Mr. Ngoc Lajering. Okay. Alright, so Ms. Cook, what about your opinion? What is the best country for studying abroad and why? Yes, um, I think uh, Canada is the best country for studying abroad. Um, because um, uh, edu education uh, uh, education can uh, of Canada is uh, development um, and uh, and uh, um, this is a beautiful country and um, mm -hmm. um, and then. Uh, Yes. How about mm -hmm. the people? Uh, the people is um, friendly and uh, all right and um. This is a uh, uh, can uh, country. Yeah. Hey, thank you, Miss Cook, about your answer. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, thank you for your answer, Miss Cook. Alright, so Miss Tang, I want to hear your opinion uh, about question two. Uh, yes, uh, what is uh, Canada is the best uh, country for studying abroad uh, because uh, Canada is uh, well known uh, for top uh, university is uh, also is uh, peer uh, 
a politi politikani a stepo and chef country and a kalada e on shower relative ni on a practice by natural a disaster teacher mm -hmm. Okay, anything else about Canada? Uh, um, oh, yes, and uh, uh, Canada uh, have, uh, have, uh, uh, have uh, the, um, no, I'm sorry, uh, uh, and uh, Canada have, uh, uh, have, um, uh, famous university. Uh, mm -hmm. um, yes. Okay. Thank you, Miss Tang, about your sharing. All right. So, in general, after hearing your talk or your opinion, you can see that America is the most worst country to study abroad. Okay. Everyone wants to go to America to study. There has the most popular uh, university in the world, like Harvard, uh, Stanford, or MIT, Massachusetts. Okay, so everyone want to come to America to study, and they also want to live live in America. Yes. Okay, so thank you for sharing with me for question two. So it was time for question three. Discuss with your partner the questions. At what age do you think students should study abroad and why? I want Miss Wang and Mr. Sin. Can you practice together? Discuss with each other. Hello, hello, Miss Wang. Hello, Miss Sin. Um, yes. Um, uh, what? Uh. I do think study uh, a student uh, should study around. Uh, yes, I think uh, students should study abroad um, at um, at uh, um, um, uh, At less uh, at under at under uh, twenty five years old, because uh, um, because uh, uh, is over. Uh, 25 years old um, still um, they uh, they are uh, they are uh, work they are suit uh, work and uh, make money uh, and uh, and um, Colleging. And then colleging is not uh, the only way. Um, yes. Uh, um, uh, what? Uh, at, uh, what? Yes. Um, I have yes. question. I have question uh, with uh, Miss Wang. At what uh, e is do you think students should um, student study study uh, abroad? Uh, I think I think uh, even uh, um, uh, fifteen. Fifteen to um over twenty. Fifteen. Um, because because 
the first season uh, can um, now uh, mark now it um, and uh, uh, can uh, travel uh, travel around um, I think so. You okay. you think so? Thank you, Miss Oang and Miss Tracy, and about your conversation. Okay, thank you. And about Miss Tracy, can you say this word again? Age. 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 Alright, Mr. Sin, can you say this word again to me? Age. 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 Alright. Okay, story. There's some problem with my uh, internet. Age. Okay, age. Good. Age. And then start. Yes, and study. Study. Yes, very good. Remember age and study, not study. Age. Study. Okay. Yes, that's good. Okay, thank you, Mr. Sian. Alright, so it's time for Mr. Nia and Miss Ngoc. Hello, Mr. Nghĩa. Mm. Yes. So, uh, I will uh, ask you first, um, uh, in your opinion, at what age do you think students should study abroad and why? Yes, uh, I think that uh, if the study has opportunity uh, the students should uh, study abroad uh, as age uh, about 20, uh, 23 years so how about you? Mm. Yes, so why? Mm. Can you uh, tell me why? Yes, uh, I think that's uh, uh, as age, uh, the children can uh, can study uh, good better, uh, study better. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. Yes, that's all. How how about mm. you? In uh, mm, in my opinion, I think it is some. Um, Seventeen. Mm, I think it's um, the the it's too suitable age because Opinion. The, when Opinion. Uh, they they are Opinion. seventeen, they grow enough and uh, they will independent. They will uh, um, they can decide for the for their future and uh, they will have a plan have plan for their future for their job and uh, they they will uh, study abroad uh, well I think so yes I see okay all right hey, very good thank you Mr. Nia and Ms. Ngoc <coughs> all right so Mr. Nia can you say again the word for me better better uh, better Better. Yes. Okay. It's no age. It's not best. It's better. Or better. 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 Yeah. Okay. Okay. Very good. This time you pronounce correctly. So about Miss Ngoc, are uh, there yes. is something I want to recorrect? They will be the independent. Independent is the adjective. Okay. Yes. We will have a to be. Before yeah. an independent, alright. Okay. Other yeah. thing, 
Yes, our thing is fantastic. Okay, very good. Thank you, Miss Ngoc. Miss Ngoc, okay. Alright, so yes. let's go. Okay, Mr. Tang, uh, Miss Tang is some uh, some problems, so you will practice with me. So, or uh, at what age do you think students should study abroad mm -hmm. and why? Uh, I think, uh, uh, I think students uh, should uh, um, um, around the age of uh, 28. Uh, um, mm -hmm. um, Why because, so uh, uh, I uh, I think uh, um, grow, growing all the we uh, had the two heads. Um, and uh, um, okay, twenty eight. So they have so many experience, right? Yeah. They can uh, be, uh, they can take care of themselves, right? So you think that what an appropriate age to study abroad? Yeah. Okay. Um. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Cool. And other things. Do you have other things to share with me? Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay. okay. If not, it's okay. Um. Are you a uh, repeat question? Okay, I I am saying that. Do you have anything to share with me about the twenty eight age? Yes, twenty eight years yes, old. Yes, yes, yes. Appropriate. Mm -hmm. Any reason do you think students should study abroad at the age of twenty eight? Other reasons? Do you have another reasons? Mm hmm. Alright, okay, it's okay. Thank you, Miss Cook, about your discussion. Alright, so Miss Tang, you're back. Uh, yes. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, sorry, teacher, I'm class uh, because I have a problem with Wi Fi, teacher. <laughs> okay, okay. I also have uh, some minutes ago. So, if we are in the question 3, can you discuss with me at what age do you think students should study abroad and why? Oh, um, uh, in uh, my opinion, uh, a student uh, uh, should st study abroad uh, in a uh, uh, Canada uh, country uh, because uh, 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 Canada is uh, well known uh, for for top uh, okay. universities. Uh, okay, uh, excuse uh, me because uh, uh, I'm interrupt you. Okay, sorry, Miss Tang, I have to interrupt you. Uh, we are asking about the age. At what age do you think students should study abroad? The age. Eight. Do you understand? Uh, oh, 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 yes. Oh, I see. Um, oh, no, no. <laughs> I, I, I don't uh, remember. I don't remember means uh, the what's that? Uh, I want teacher. Mm -hmm. I want ask teacher. Uh, uh, what's the this mean uh, Vietnamese? Uh, uh, mean the what's the eight? Uh, eight. eight? Yes, the thank you, teacher. Eight. Okay, mm -hmm. I see, I see. Oh, yes. Uh, I think uh, I think uh, uh, I think a uh, student have uh, have as uh, have as um, a nineteen nineteen uh, when a uh, student uh, study abroad uh, because uh, 
because uh, when that um, teacher, uh, when that student um, uh, uh, understand uh, uh, and uh, knowledge, uh, knowledge everything, mm. Mm. Uh, everything uh, uh, is the is where it goes uh, for a student uh, when uh, study abroad and. Uh, and go to uh, far, far homes uh, and uh, parent, parents, uh, parents, uh, st student. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Miss Tang, about your sharing. All right. Okay. We can have some suggestion I give you, and also in my opinion. Whenever you have careful preparation, you can study abroad. It depends and varies among people. You don't have to worry about the age. Just uh, you can study abroad whenever you have the careful preparation. All right. Okay, so let's turn to question four. Our last question today is the role play. A. Your friend is planning to planning on studying abroad, so talk with him or her about it. And your B. Your student A friends talk with him or her. All right. So this time, Miss Wang will uh, have a pair work with Miss Tang. All right. So Miss Wang, you will be A, and B. Is Miss Tang. Miss Tang will be the person who is planning on studying abroad. Okay. So A, can you give B some advice and some tips when studying abroad? Yes. Yeah. So let's start. Oh. Hello, me. Uh, hello, Ang. How are you today? I'm fine, thanks. And you? Oh, I'm good, thanks. Um, uh, what uh, what you are blending? Uh, okay, no, I'm sorry. Uh, do you have uh, blendings in the last year? Yes, I have. Uh, I have blended the last only around. Um. Uh, Study around uh, uh, Australia. Oh, Australia. Oh. That's oh, yes, I see. Uh, what else? Mm, no. I, I, I don't have, um, plan it. You can look at uh, my suggestion. Um, uh, where, uh, what, uh, what university will uh, you study? Um, I, uh, Eastern, uh, I don't know, uh, can you, uh, sharing me? University, a uh, university, and um, and weather very cold, very cold. Um, I, I think uh, when you uh, when you studying uh, in the Australia, um, Australia, you should uh, you should um, uh, you should uh, list uh, uh, you should. Uh, the language and the culture and the campus and the transportation 
um, speaking French is not easy. I'm um, a personal safety and uh, a cost of uh, living. Um, that's, that's uh, do you uh, uh, speak uh, English uh, uh, well sorry. now? Do you speak English? Uh, sorry, can you speak uh, louder? Oh, I see. Um, uh, do you uh, speak English well now? Yes. I, uh, uh, that I do. I have, oh. uh, a oh. and I, uh, I want to, uh, uh, because, uh, I think, Okay, so let's turn to Mr. Sien and Miss Ngoc. All right, so let's start. Yes, hello, Miss Ngoc. Hello. Hello, Miss Sien. Yes, uh, hello, Miss Sien. Nice to meet you. Um. Yes. Uh, nice to meet I you. I heard you uh, are planning to study abroad. Is that true? <laughs> yes, uh, uh, I have planned to America to uh, complete my master degree. <laughs> and uh, what about you? Uh, yes, I um, um, I I I wish I um, I going to uh, America, America yeah. to complete my master degree but i uh, can't afford it um can you uh, can you tell me uh, uh can you tell me each per each person each parents um from uh, um study uh, study uh, abroad mm, I think uh, you will you uh, should have plan uh, to get a scholarship uh, and uh, plan uh, to apply for visa uh, yes uh, um, after that you yes after that you should uh, uh, research your destination local country and people oh and but uh, but first you uh, have to uh, plan to get scholarship <laughs> <laughs> uh, so. yeah mm. um uh, uh, what um what do you know? Uh, um, um, what do you know? Uh, Nature discussed uh, in uh, America. Um, I I have no idea. Uh, what is this? Uh, I think uh, I think. Right. Okay, so. Uh, Okay, sorry, Mr. Sen and Ms. Ngoc, because uh, our time is running out, so we yeah. have to end the conversation here. So sorry, 
Okay, it's uh, too late for you to anyone you to close this. Uh, okay, so Mr. Sin, there's one word I want you to practice again. Experience. 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 Yes, yes. Yes, okay, much better. Okay, thank you, Mr. Sian. Alright, so, Miss Cook, okay? Yeah. Okay, so I've heard you're planning to study abroad, if that's true? Uh, yes, I, I, I apply to study in Korea. Oh, congratulations! So, yeah. what university will you study in Korea? Um, I I have a study in Korea about uh, agriculture. Hmm. Okay. So it will be a university about uh, agriculture. Alright. Um, so yeah, I I I want study uh, about. Uh, in Korea about uh, uh, I uh, I want uh, complex uh, master degree in uh, Korea about agriculture. Okay, okay. I also want to study abroad, but I couldn't afford the tuition fee, so. Uh, I uh, I'm very glad when you uh, receive a uh, a scholarship uh, to study in Korea. Yes. So have oh. you uh, prepared anything for your studying abroad? Mm. About your preparation, have you uh, searched about the culture? The weather, the climate in Korea. Uh, um, I. Uh, um, so. Uh, in, so, um, so, I I like uh, I like. Uh, um, I like the culture. Uh, I like culture of uh, Korea and um, uh, the people and the people um, is friendly. Um, yeah. I I I like I like uh, I like food of uh, Korea. Um, I, I I I like. Uh, Kimchi. Um, mm. yeah. Okay. And, uh, okay, that was very good. I hope you can prepare yourself very yes. good for your next semester at Korea. So have a nice and wonderful year there. Alright, yes. so goodbye. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Goodbye. Thank you, Miss Cook. Okay, sorry because uh, our class is over. Yeah, I have some problems and I uh, turned to the class late. So sorry, guy. So let's put all the things together. Today we have a discussion about context, where to study abroad, and in the vocabulary part we have find the difference between the s and sh sounds. So I kindly request you to find the homework to practice more at home. All right. So thank you, all of you, for joining class today. Oh, it's a new day now. Okay, so goodbye and have a sweet dream, everyone. Good bye. Good bye. Goodbye.